Hello friends. So today's session we will discuss about how to configure and change guest OS from VMware level. Okay. So generally when you are like suppose if you have your own lab and you working any organization and when you log into your vCenter and searching with your VM. So probably may, maybe you will get this kind of warning message you can see on my screen. So basically this warning message is indicating which can, uh, which version operating system you are using like server you are using that same version is not selected from the VMware level. So that you have to change it. Okay. Once you change then this message will be not appear. Okay. So before I start let me tell you one thing. So like before you going to change you should have to power off your VM otherwise you cannot do. So this activity you cannot do online. Like if your VM is running, then you cannot do. Okay. So suppose if you are on your VM and that VM application or database is running, then you have to stop the application and database and then you have to power off and then you can change. So basically you need a downtime to do this activity. Okay. Okay. So like why I'm telling you like you cannot do online. Let me show you. So once you select the VM, then you can go to edit setting, click on the edit setting. Once you click on the edit setting, then you can go click on the VM option. Once you click on the VM option, then you can click on the general option. And the general option, you can see here guest OS version is showing. Okay. So this here we can do the changing. But as of now, you can see it's a disable. Why? Because my VM is running. Okay, fine. So let me power off this VM first. Okay, and then so before I'm power off, let me show you which version I'm holding operating system. So you can see I'm holding CentOS 7. Let me clear. Let me restart this my machine. Sorry, let connect to my machine. I connected. Let me check the version. So you can see I'm I'm using CentOS 7.9. Okay, fine. So what I have to do, I have to power off the machine. So right mouse click, go to the power and click on the power off. Okay, click on the yes. So now you can see my machine is, uh, system is a power off. So now you can click on the edit, edit setting, and then you can go to the VM option, and then you can click on the general option, and now you can see it's a this option is enabled. So click here and you can select. So which version? 7, CentOS 7. So I am selecting CentOS 7 here. Okay. So because why it sent uh, OS 7.9, why it's not showing here? Because see, I'm uh, using the, I'm using the old EXI host version. So that's why. Okay. If you're using the new one, like new version, latest version, then you know, you will get the option 7.9 also here. Okay. Now you have to click on the save option. Once you click here, you can see now it's a change. Okay. Now let me power on, click on the power on. Now this warning message, it will not show here because we change that one. Okay. That version. So that like, you know, like this is a process. I can say this is a process. You can do the change the guest OS setting. So I hope uh, uh, you like this video. So please subscribe my channel, comment and share it. Thanks for your watching.